Good morning and welcome to today's lesson. Uh, in today's lesson, we are going to look at uh, tangents of acute angles. As we looked at uh, the previous lesson, we said that tangent is a trigonometric ratio. It is a ratio of the opposite side of a triangle divided by the adjacent side, uh, depending on the angle you are looking at. So today we are going to find tangent of, of, of acute angles. You know acute angles are angles which are less than 90 degrees. So we are going to see how you can read this from the mathematical tables. So I hope you are armed with your mathematical table. I want you to go to your mathematical table and open uh, the page that is written natural tangents natural tangents don't look at logarithm of tangents it is natural tangent so we are going to use those tables and we're going to use them just as you used uh, logarithm tables so you have been able to read logarithm tables in your form 2 work in form 1 you are able to read uh, reciprocal tables you are able to read uh, squares or tables of squares in form 2 again you are able to read tables of cubes and also cube root. So we are going to use a, a similar concept. Actually, it is more of revision of the same. Uh, what I want you to note as we look at this is uh, on the side where we normally add, even in this tables of natural, natural tangents, that is the mean differences, we are still going to add them. So I want you, or I want us to look at or to find the tangent. Find from tables, tan 42.49 degrees. So what you do from your table, you have this part written x, you move all the way to 42, just as you are doing in uh, organisms. So you move all the way to 42. Then here you have 0.0, .0 all the way, uh, 0 0.2, so you go up to 0 0.4 and you read this, this, this figure which is here. And remember, you have to note at 0, 0.0, there's a number here, 0 point. So as you move on, then this 0 point might change. So the 0 point has not been repeated within the table, but for you, you have to carry on this 0 point. That 0 point may change as you move on. So at 0 0.4, 42.4 now, you are going to read at uh, 0.4 from the table, you are going to read 9131. 9131. But don't forget it's 0. Point. So it's 0. 0.9131. Then we have the mean differences that is written add. Up here, it's written add. That is where we are going to read our 9. So at 9, we have one, two, three, all the way up to nine. So at nine, you read this number down here uh, alongside 42, and it is 29. Just we were, as we were doing, you add. So it will be 0 0.9131. You add 29 from the, from the end, from the left. Sorry, from the right. So you get here zero, you get here six, you get here one, you get here nine. So that is the, the, the tangent of 42.49. It is 0 0.9160. You also remember that in our previous lesson, I taught you how to change angles from degrees to minutes and vice versa. So can you find, find tan 66 uh, degrees? This one should not be there. 66 degrees. 35 minutes, 35 minutes, find tan of that. In this one, you must change 35 minutes into degrees so that you are able to read directly. So you have to divide it by 60 using your shortcut. So your angle will be 66 points. You can check this. I think it will be 0.58 degrees. So you're going to read this now from the table of tangents. You can pause a bit and then you go to your tables and read 
the tangent of 66.58. See whether it will be 2.3086. Something that to note here is that this last digit might differ slightly depending on the addition of the mathematical table you are using. Uh, those ones are normally called proportional parts towards the end, and they might differ slightly because they are normally an estimation. Mine here is, uh, I think, the fourth edition. So you could be using the sixth, and they could be slightly different. So that is it. That is how we read uh, the angles from mathematical tables. You can also be able to move back. You can be given this tangent for you to move back. You remember the way we were reading the tables of cubes? That same way. It is the way you're you going to go back and you're able to get this angle. So if you're given this as your tangent, you will read it from within the table. From within the table. For example, if you're given tan theta is equals to 0 0.4296. That is tan theta. I want you to go to within the tables and find uh, the angle which will be close to 42.96, if not exact. You may not get exact, but you try to get the one which is closest and you estimate. So just as you are reading the table of cube roots, go back and see. And your angle there, the one you're going to get, uh, just try it is going to be 23.25 or thereabout. So that's how we get uh, angles from our tangents of angles from mathematical tables. Acute angles, remember. For other angles which are not acute, that will be another part of trigonometry, which will be trigonometry 2, which you will be taught later. So that's our lesson for today. I'm going to be giving you an assignment later. Uh, I hope it is clear. Thank you.